Okay, so in this episode we are going to be adding this uh, fin bracket. We're going to be making the fin and also doing the hatch and then possibly if we get time adding some of the uh, what I would call the sanding bits. Now, at the moment looking at the pictures this is how it goes. But the next picture when you turn over and a couple of pictures along it's showing the whole of this area is covered in a sheet. Now I have spoken to Angel Angel Wings because the issue is is that when that is sitting down on that complete sheet it's not going to fit down properly. So what I've done with the bit that I uh, was left over from my accidental T slot I've infilled just here. just that bit there but I'm leaving this area empty for the canopy to sit down the benefit of this is is that when we flip it over and when we look at it we've just doubled the gluing surface to stick the fit the, the fin holder on so I'm gluing that in there and if you can see that let me just put that there I'm putting that filler in there but keeping these runners, as I like to call them, free. So that's the bit I'm adding. I'm adding that bit and then I'm going to then glue that onto there. Okay, next two bits you're going to need. This is for your fin. Just make sure you've got the orientation right. You want both your tags, that tag, that tag and that tag all the same way. I'm just going to glue that together. Okay, so that's the fin dropped into the slot in the front, two slots at the back. Um, be very careful. I would say that this is quite a weak area here, so just be careful when you're putting the uh, fin in. Now, I'm not gluing it in at the moment. What I want to do is I'm just going to get a nice uh, rounded edge, and I'm going to cover this first before I actually uh, fix it to the plane. But anyway that's what it looks like put that away somewhere safe okay next thing you're going to need is this chap here this is the magnet holder for the catch this fits in here now a little tip here I'm going to glue mine out of being fitted and what you want to try and do is make sure that this is fitting, is fitting flush and when I say fitting flush you don't want it standing proud because there's uh, the canopy is going to be sitting on top so that's all I'm doing just making sure and then I'm just going to glue that in place next next bits you're going to need will be the canopy and these two rails now it's a very clever little technique here cut the whole of this canopy out to start off with do not cut across there do not cross a cut across here all will be made obvious very shortly Mice just asked me to uh, try these apparently these are a new scone recipe well it's a tough job but somebody's got to do it oh just to let you know there were four so you're going to need that that and this remember what I said don't um, cut these two end pieces off that's critical and the orientation is that small ring there is obviously going to drop over the magnet like so mm. okay the actual gluing of the hatch I've cleaned them up these little bits now you can see they've got a bit of a curve to them because obviously the fuselage has got a slight curve to it so I have put a bit of scrap just here put a bit of scrap just there now don't go 
this side of that and push down because you'll break that off and we don't want to break that off at the moment so put your scrap bit of wood inside these two slots remember that this little the little notch there goes to the front and then all I'm going to do is I'm going to pop them in there like that and then I'm going to push down which gives me the curve and then I'm going to glue them so all I'm going to do is I'm going to push down that gives me the curve so there's my hatch look at that beautiful curve that worked really well so I'm just going to drop that into there like so well look at that that is literally the first time I've put that in that's superb now what we're going to do now is I am just going to cut these off drop the hatch back in and then we're going to glue these in place so we get a lovely flush finish okay I've taken the hatch off I've cut these out and now what I'm going to do is when I'm happy with the position and the hatch is down securely this one I'm going to glue in place as is the one in the rear I am going to take the fuselage back out stick the hatch back in and then stick that in place because what, what I don't want to be doing is adding glue to this area because what I don't want to do is it accidentally gluing itself um, to the wrong bit of the structure but okay so uh, I'd obviously fixed that before I, I then took the canopy off I took the fuselage out I dropped the fuselage Pop this hatch straight back in and then glued that in place with it out with it off of the actual aircraft like so and that's how it fits beautiful so we've got one last thing to do on this episode right last thing for this episode um, I have I'm just going to add these and I'm just going to use my Gorilla Glue wood glue I'm going to clamp one there and one underneath and I'm going to leave them overnight to glue and then I'm going to sand them down to shape to get a nice profile so that on either side of the leading edge is the first is the last thing I'm going to do.